Time just for a couple more. Hi. Hi. Um, I know somebody already asked about the pranks and everything, but uh, what has been, and this is for everybody, what has been like, has there been a moment where something really amusing or something really just out of the blue has happened while, during production that's been funny or strange or just not super happy or anything, but, um, <laughs> Oh, there's stuff that happens all the time. I mean, even just yesterday, I was shooting a scene with, uh, with a little boy who comes up and gives me a hug, and he has this uh, like Nintendo case in his in his hand, and, and it hooks to my jacket. And as he takes off, <laughs> you know, and that was that was just another time. And yesterday as well, I was, I was supposed to reach in the Impala and grab my bag. Well, the, the, the props person had shut the bag's strap in the door, so you know, that was like. <laughs> It's a, it's a constant occurrence, and usually you'll see them on the guy <laughs> One quick question, and really random. What was the music for the uh, film realm that was played? Oh, that, that's a Robert Rodriguez song for, I think, Once Upon a Time in Mexico. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, and Phil Sugrisha, again, he cut that uh, at the end of last season instead of working. <laughs> so, but, yeah. Can I get two more? During the last season, you did some really, really excellent promos. Uh, I was really glad to see the Pro-Max yeah. PBA giving five awards for, uh, for those promos. Um, I was wondering if you are preserving those, will they, will they be available on the DVD collections, things like the, the <laughs> Johnny Cash God's Gonna Cut You Down? Yeah. No, but what a great idea. <laughs> Uh, you know, the season two DVD is already done, and unfortunately, uh, those promos aren't on them. But um, but that's a really great idea for the future. I mean, yeah, some of those are really uh, badass. And actually, I have to give the I, you know, uh, there's two guys, Anthony and Chris, at the CW, who are like as passionate about the show as everybody here, and they're always like cutting these promos and showing them to us. And they they, they cut that Johnny Cash thing, and they're you know they're really kicking an ass. So, um, but but no, not on the DVD, unfortunately. But maybe you know maybe we'll figure out someplace. Fantastic. I hope there are some people here who've never seen Supernatural who are now going to go home and start watching. Hello. I just wanted to know who the genius behind the music, if it was one person or a group yes. effort on choosing. Uh, it's a group effort. Uh, I, uh, you know, I'm the one who says, don't even bring me anything after 1980. Yeah. But, uh, but, uh, uh, Phil Sigrisha, we have a music supervisor, Alex, and um, and you know everyone's always combing for like, you know what's what's a foreigner song or you know or or you know what's the classic rock song we haven't heard yet that we all remember but we haven't heard in like ten years that we can put in the show. So no, it's definitely uh, definitely a team effort. Well, it's all very very good. Thanks. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, before uh, we have to wrap it up, I know you have something you want to say. Yeah, the one thing I want to say is 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 uh, uh, kind of a combination. Thank you so much and also sort of a mission. Um, season three, guys, we got, it, it was a little touch and go whether or not there was gonna be a season three, and I want us to make sure that there is a season four. We, we love the show, uh, we love the show, and we're passionate about it, and, and what we always talk about amongst ourselves is we have uh, some of the smartest, most passionate, most intelligent fans of any show on television. I would ask you, I mean, you know, in a certain way, season four is in the audience's hands. And so, you know, tell your friends and spread the word and, and, and spread the gospel of Supernatural because yeah. we're going to keep we're gonna keep making them as long as, you know, we have the audience to watch it. So um, I would I would ask for your help and, and it's a team effort. We're sort of all in it together. But but for now, you guys are the greatest. And we have, we, again, we have the best fans. And thank you so damn much.